Hey guys, what's going on? My name's Tom, and I'm going to show you the beginner's guide to fitting in at any music festival. Step one, you just figure out what you want to wear. So wear some overalls and a brimmed hat like this. It'll make you look like you work on a corn farm and you haven't seen rain since you were a child. Wearing circle brim glasses like this will make you look artsy. It'll also make you look like you're here for the music. When in actual fact, you're just trying to hide the size of your pupils from security. Another option for headwear is the classic conductor's hat. Wearing this type of hat will make you look like an off-duty train driver. We'll let everyone know that you're a f In every outfit you wear to a festival, you have to include some glitter. Just to show off the true boho queen that you are. When the sun goes down and it starts to get cold, but let's face it, you're too drunk to even care, get yourself a bloody classic Byron Bay poncho, because you've been there once and now you're a local. It won't keep you warm at all, but it will let security know that you do know domestic violence and so you're not afraid to use it. It's time to pack the essentials. You need two essential things to get through any festival and to make best friends. Step one, pack yourself some chewing gum. And step two, get yourself a bloody lighter. These two very simple things can be traded for anything from a vodka Red Bull to a patch with that girl that's been on every set of shoulders in the mosh pit. Now that you're wearing the right clothes and you've packed the essentials, it's time to learn how to act. If you do these three things, you'll look and feel like every other durry muncher and pill head in the crowd. Number one, Number two, And number three, last but not least, the very most important thing you can do if you want to go to a music festival. Snapchat. Everything. Everything. Lining up at the toilets. Lining up at the bar. Lining up to get in. Lining up to get out. Lining up to get on a bus to go home. Everything. If your Snapchat story isn't at least four hours long detailing every single thing that happened at this festival, including the drunk chick throwing up next to the toilets, did you even really go? Now with everything being said, you're ready to go festival. Now go and rave like you've never raved before and mosh in all the pits possible. You're welcome. Thanks for watching the video guys. If you enjoyed it, leave a like and subscribe. Share it around with your friends, you know. Get this mug on every Facebook screen on, in Australia. Um, and yeah, tell me in the comment section below what you want to see me do next. I'll see you in the next video. Adios.